Not you again. This is no place for kids. Oh, I'm safe. The children of chaos, they look after me. If you ask me, you're the one who doesn't belong. Is no that important that you chase him here? We were on the same side once. Friends, I guess. But that was such a long, long time ago. Do you think he's still your friend? See, there's only one person Null ever truly loved, and she's long gone. The Children of Chaos told me the whole story. It's a sad but sweet tale of a proud hunter and his friend, a girl called Yule. Oh, poor Yule. She left a hole in his heart that just can't be filled. It's not surprising, though, considering that she died in his arms. In those last moments they had, she looked up and said to him, Don't cry, Noel. We will meet again in the future. Like you'd believe that, right? But Yule was a seeress who could see the future. Now, Noel knew that. So when she told him they would be reunited, what else could he do? He had to believe her. And so, he's been waiting ever since. The poor sad fool. Centuries and centuries of waiting. All on his own. How could I have missed that? All this time, the one thing that's kept him going are his memories of Yule. Oh no, not his memories. The promise of a future gave him hope. There's another oracle drive up ahead. When you see the prophecy, you'll understand. You'll see why. Huh. He wants you, Dad. I've spotted Noel. I'm going after him. Light, don't be too hasty. He has to be egging me on, drawing me toward the killing ground. It's like he needs everything to be perfect, everything to be just right for his prophesized set piece. Don't make light of this. The prophecy is real enough. The moment you die, the world dies with you. You can't forget. What I don't understand is why he's hell bent on making the prophecy come true. What does he gain from it? Maybe he saw something else. A future that looks better as long as I'm dead. Unfurl the wings of death! Fate is what it is. I saw this coming.
unfurl the wings of death. Fate is what it is. Unfurl the wings of death. Can you see my blade? So this is the prophesized future. By killing the savior, a brand new world will be born. Yule. So that's it. All this time, you've been dreaming of a new world where you're reunited with Yule. It's no dream, Lightning. The future is right there in the Oracle Drive. If I kill the Savior, then the world will be reborn. And this time, it's going to happen like it's supposed to. It's going to work. I failed once before, long ago. But you know that story. I defeated a friend because I believed that would save everyone. Everything went wrong. Yes, I won our fight like I was supposed to. And then he died. But that just unleashed the chaos that's tearing this world apart. So yeah, I destroyed the world. It's a hell of a thing. Snow never blamed or judged me, though. And Hope tried to lead humanity in the fight against the chaos. Of course I fought alongside them both. Damn it, but we were fools back then. We might as well have spat in the wind the good it did. I'd already signed the world's death warrant. Five short centuries, that's all we had. <laughs> and now even that's gone. No. It wasn't your fault. It never was. If anyone's to blame, it's me. Maybe you're right. But you know what? I don't think it even matters anymore. I'm only interested in creating a new future. That prophecy is the key to my dream. My dream of seeing Yule again. I'm going to make it happen. It's nothing personal, Lightning. I wish... I really wish the prophecy didn't show you dying. But it does, and I'm sorry, but I'm going to make it happen. Five hundred years ago, I committed the ultimate sin. One more death on my conscience won't do anything to me. It has to be done! <laughs> <laughs> That god of yours gave you some serious power. I'd call it a mixed blessing. I'm more powerful than I ever was, but it came with a price. I'm not even sure if I'm human anymore. Not human? What are you, Lightning? I wish I knew. Believe me. I've taken a lot of lives. More than I can count. If I had any humanity left, I would have been crushed by the guilt by now. Do I look crushed to you? I am going to see Sarah again. I'm going to fight for as long as it takes. Give whatever it takes, even if it's my humanity. But you're not like me, Noel. I know you're different, even if it's for the future. Even if it's to see Yule again. You don't have it in you to kill me. You're still human. You killed a friend once in order to save the world, and you can't do it again. Right? You know it's true. I can see it in your eyes. You think you're safe from me? Sure about that? No. But the clock is ticking on this world, and I've got things to do before time runs out. You don't want to get in my way, Noel. You might still have scruples, but I don't. Not anymore. Damn it, Lightning! 
Is this all you are now? That's right. To save Sarah, I'll throw everything else away. I'll even be God's little pawn. No one's gonna stop me from trying. Not even you. You want to find Yule? Then find her in death! Oh, I'll find her, all right. <laughs> Count on it. But we'll both be alive. In a new future. In a new world that I'm gonna make happen with my own two hands! Even if it means destroying you! To make the prophecy come true, you think you have to kill me. of death. Sorry for this!
into the unseen void. The prophecy has to come true. Your dream is over, Noel. Let it go. The Hunter has failed to kill the Savior. Your prophesied future won't come true. It's all over now. You think I'll give up that easy, Savior? I'm not done yet. I am going to kill you. Sure, do your worst. Yule's still waiting for you. That's right, I'll do it for Yule's sake. Even if it means having your blood on my hands. I know if she was here, she'd try to stop me. She's gonna be disappointed as hell in me, at least for a while. But she'll get over it. And I need this future. It will be done! Didn't you do it? Because Yule... She wouldn't... This isn't what she would want. She had the power to see into the future. Every terrible vision she saw, one after another, whittled her life away. She must have known all along when she would die, and how she would die. But even so, she never gave up hope. She didn't stop trying to make things better for all of us. She didn't stop smiling. Yet, what did I do? I saw one prophecy and I let it control me. I didn't try to fix anything, just try to kill you to make it come true. I can't do it. I wouldn't be able to look her in the eye if I did. But you destroyed the machine. Maybe that prophecy was my last chance to see Yule, but maybe it's better this way. Maybe it's better to never see her again than make more mistakes. <sighs> Did you hear that? <sighs> Yule! Say sorry, but I did try to kill you. I don't think a simple apology is going to cut it. Even if I pushed you into it? You've had five long centuries to brood on what happened. And I come along and force you into a corner. Maybe I'm the one who should apologize. But you was right. You belong in the future. And I can take you there. You deserve a new beginning in a new world. A new world. So is your god building us a paradise? <sighs> Not exactly. It's just an ordinary place, with ordinary people, working hard together to make it as good as it can be. <laughs> Doesn't sound like the Shadow Hunter would be welcome there. Hey, but if I'm gonna get a second lease on life, maybe it's time I stopped living in the shadows. Right, Lightning?
light? How did you know he was gonna do that? I was sure he was about to kill you. Did you sense something? I didn't know. I took a gamble on him and hoped he'd come up with the right answer. Lucky for us, he did.